morning, we are from Tesma. We are going to make four experiments based on water. Um, okay, so for the first experiment is water bridge. Um, so we, we just we use some tissue, water and liquors. Um, so we are going to uh, twist the tissue to make the experiment run more effectively. effectively. Okay. So first, um, we're gonna put the tissue into the water. Okay. Um, as the result, um, we can see the water runs through the tissue. Okay. So um, the experiment will take time, and from and in in the time, um, we go we will move on to the next experiment. For this experiment, you need two balloons and a candle. As you can see, this balloon is empty. You look when you get it near the fire, it will blow up. Because the fire will hit the balloon and make it weak, and then it will blow up. But, as you can see, there's water inside the balloon. And if you put it near, it doesn't blow up because the water absorbs the heat and uh, the, the heat will, go not, will not go to the balloon and it stay strong. Let's go to the next experiment. Okay, for this experiment, we are going to show you what is called refraction. Okay, now you can see the image behind this beaker. It's an arrow pointing to my left. Uh, but when you put a water, when you put water in the beaker, you will see that the image is actually reversed. Right now, what you are seeing is uh, the arrow is pointing to my right, but actually it's still pointing to my left. What is happening right here is called refraction. It's when light passes through a medium, which uh, in this experiment is uh, the water, the medium. Uh, the light will refract or bend, so it will make your eyes perceive it as uh, a reverse image. Now, let's go to the next experiment. For the experiment, you can need a beaker, also a candle, and a plate of water. When you put the glass on the top, what you can look is the water get into the beaker. This is because a burning need an oxygen. So when the burning, the oxygen is run out, the burning will gone. So there is an empty space in the beaker. So the water will fill up the beaker to make it full. Now let's see the result of the water bridge experiment. Um, okay, um, as you can see here, um, half of the work of half of the tissue has been colored, and the water get through the tissue. Um, this occurs because the cohesive forces, cohesive forces of the water and the tissue are stronger than the adhesive forces of of the of the water itself. Okay. So that is all our four experiments. I hope you had fun watching this video and you learned something from it. Uh, so that's all from us. Thank you.